Hello ladles and jelly spoons, I'm back. Um, doing a regular video this time, I decided not to do a hangout um, because I really don't want to talk about religion in this video. Um, I save the hangouts for kind of my religious discussions now. Um, although I should probably do a video on religion too, but I, maybe that will be later. Um, but th this one here is about um, the trans community and it is a community I I have a love-hate relationship of it. While I am technically a part of it because I am trans, it's something I am not, um, I'm not always on board with. The only thing that holds us together is the fact that we're trans. Um, it's kind of like the atheist community, you know, the only, the only thing they hold in common is that they lack a belief in a god or gods. And this topic is about, um, something you guys may have heard about, the, the whole RuPaul using the words trainee or she now. So there's this campaign going out now that's like hashtag RuPaul and it, the people are holding a note or something that says, you know, we won't be silenced or whatever the case may be. Um, something similar to that. Um, in opposition to RuPaul's use of select words and language. People that are having an issue are saying we won't be silenced, but yet they're doing it to create the idea that the person should not be using these words. In turn, silencing that person. I find it a bit hypocritical. Um, it's something that I obviously am not going to take part of. I've seen quite a few people on Facebook and Twitter that have taken part in this. It amazes me the hypocrisy in the world, um, and this just being one case in, in many. So if you really think that, you know, posting pictures of you holding up a sign is going to get someone to stop using certain words in their, in their language, um, I would have to disagree. I would, I would say it's a futile effort. But I honestly think that if anything, this whole campaign to try to silence people or to get them to adjust their vernacular to your liking is only going to further separate people in this community even more. In the grand scheme of things, it's meaningless. Getting people to use the words transsexual or transgender or just trans is not going to cause people to start giving us rights. What we should be worrying about is, you know, the bigger things. Put our efforts into things that actually mean something in life, rather than a word which, you know, only you can give meaning to. So anyway, yeah, that's what I've got for today. Um, hope you enjoyed seeing me and hearing my crap again. Um, I always say I'm going to try to make video more videos, but um, when time permits, I will do another video. Um, so that's all I can say. Um, have a great day, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.